Speakers Live Fieldhouse in Indianapolis. Steve McClure along with Coach Chuck Bennett from Speedway High School here in Indy. And Coach, we could not ask for We could not. We might get extra basketball. Free basketball for that matter. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'm looking forward to seeing what uh, Coach Hawkins comes up with here. I'll be interested to see too. Coach Adams might switch defenses. He's let me run this. Three. Let me run this by you. In the 2017 IHSA Boys Basketball State Tournament, there have been 22 overtimes that decided games. Uh, in the sectional round, I heard exactly. That. Yes, and so there may be another one today. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you what. Uh, let me know in 36 seconds, okay? Well, you could be the one calling. <laughs> so Just kidding. You. All right. We are tied at 71 apiece. Christmas Addicts will get it out. Bryce Bennington had been at the line for two shots. He missed the first, but made the second to tie things up. Here's Robert Cooley crossing the 10 second line and a foul on the backside. This will go against Matt Conrad. And again, that is uh, team foul number six against the Indians, so one more. And Addicts will go to the one and one. 29 seconds and counting. Let's see if the Tigers will elect to go with that one shot. And if so, I'm going to look for Nike here, right here in front of us. Clock coming down at 15 seconds and running. We are tied at 71 apiece. Robert Cooley, seven seconds, coming to the basket. He stops, takes a jumper, no good. On the rebound is Jimbo Harris and the Alex Tigers have won. Jamal Again, taking the jump shot from the free throw line. What a tip in by Jamal Harris. He has been a big time player for this Christmas Addicts Tigers team. 73, 71, nine tenths of a second left. And again, it was Johnny on the spot, Jamal Harris, who came in to tap that thing in. It was Jamal Harris just one week ago today down at Seymour that pumped in 29 points to lead the Christmas Addicts Tigers to that victory. Another tight one against Evansville Bossy to march their way to the state finals. Again, the officials are gathering at the center here to have a meeting. Nine tenths of a second left. And Coach, where are they going to get it out of bounds? At the far court? Yeah, it's underneath because it's after a made basket, so they're going to run the baseline. Uh, I'm sure that Coach Adams is going to push plays like this. I don't know if it's been in nine tenths of a second. But at least you have time to catch and shoot if you need to do that. I don't know if I look for something long down toward their basket. Uh, got a lot of options.